Hello ladies and gentlemen, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to Reassembly Season 7. We're now on Episode 5, and we're playing the Cephalopodian Syndicate, part of the Red Faction, and it's going fairly well. We did finally manage to build a ship that is capable of defending itself, and as a matter of fact, let's go to our ship here. Our ship deserves a name, and this is offered by a seventh son, a name inspired by the Lovecraftian worlds of the Cthulhu Mythos, Dagon. <laughs> Dagon, Priest of the Deep Ones. Yes, I'm going to spill out the whole thing. Priest of the Deep Ones. Yes. I love Cthulhu Mythos. I love Lovecraftian. I just, it's so, it makes me so happy. I love the deep, the deep dark tones of the Cthulhu mystery. I love it. Wonderful. Okay, so perfect. We've got Dagon set up. I think what we're going to do is we're going to take along our mothership here and we're going to start going after the Borg. We do have some agents coming in, so we do need to be cautious. But I think this episode is going to be about making... Hold on. Oh, I've got to turn off command. This is, episode is going to be about making money, about making that R so that we can build up our faction. And I think this ship deserves its own factory. Oh, look at all the ships coming in to take all of our R. Hey, how dare you? Back off. <laughs> you know what we need to do? We need to get a factory on the ship. I think that's key, and I think we'll do that right now. Let's do it right now. Uh, just one simple addition to the ship. We do need to upgrade and get that factory. There we go. I don't know how that's going to fit on here. <laughs> I Oh, hmm. Give me one second. Ah, uh, yes. I think we will put a factory on either side. So we're going to put one over here. Because it needs to be balanced. It needs. To, it doesn't need to be. I'm not. It doesn't have to be symmetrical. But I like it. I would like it to be mostly symmetrical, except for the tentacles. The tentacles don't need to be symmetrical. So it can spawn out the side. So we're gonna do the same exact thing to the other side as well here. Uh, delete. Delete. And then we'll grab this. This. Whoops. Oh, all of these. Perfect. Like so. And then. C, V, M, perfect, and sticker in there, perfect. Now, we do need to upgrade the size of our ship. Perfect, perfect, and we're ready to go. And now we have two factories on here. And actually, that looks kind of nice. I like it. Okay, let's get out. Whoops, save, perfect. Ah, yes, now they will bring the uh, R to me, lovely. So go ahead, collect my pretties, collect it all. <laughs> Ooh, something that we forgot to do. Let's go to three. Let's add some ships in our queue. We definitely want to have more of our Dagons. Uh, let's create a copy like so. And let's, we can produce uh, some tricklets, sure. Recons, yes, no, no tricklets. I don't want any tricklets. I do want some more Humboldt miners. I would like some jfsx ones so the only thing that's going to be expensive here is of course the priest and we'll get a priest every third build look at this beautiful we're just crushing them oh fantastic now we do have agents coming in quickly um fairly quickly they will be here but look at this we're completely decimating the borg <laughs> forget about assimilation board it borg it's all over it's all over for you guys they don't really stand a chance here like we're just oh just amazing Amazing how quickly we can actually just wipe through them. It's lovely. Okay. I for... Oh, yes. It's F to spawn ships. Yes, it's been a while. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, yes, we've got our mo other mothership in here. Maybe we don't need to keep this mothership on our... There we go. The mothership can sort of go on its own. Let's see if we can get to that other factory that's close by and get that spawned up before the agents get here. But in the meantime, just crush the board. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, this is lovely. Absolute decimation. None shall survive. This is... Hey, who's that? I think this was an old agent that I actually killed already. Pretty sure. There he goes. <laughs> before I started recording, there was an agent right on top of me. I'm pretty sure that's that's the agent group I've already destroyed today. <laughs> <laughs> I was I just started playing and there was an agent right there so I just killed her like instantaneously it was awesome so that's it I think well we still have some more Borg to kill over here today's gonna be about you know flexing our flexing our muscles Ooh, here we go let's grab this oh we're gonna start getting really powerful here guys really powerful I love it there's another factory another mothership on its way I wonder if we'll start uh, seeing some more of the some of the Dagons maybe as some of the motherships because they have factories now I don't know I'm not sure exactly how that works very fun though a couple more of these to destroy we're not getting a we're not getting nearly the money I was like the R that I thought we were gonna get from this but we are making a little bit enough enough to make it worth our while and, and these are easy kills too right 
perfect. Our mothership's just staying close to us and healing us. Maybe we should keep our mothership, that mothership on our wing. You know, that's actually not a terrible idea. That way, uh, that way we always have those healing beams available to us. We do, we could keep a couple sepias on our wing too. That's actually a great idea. The sepias have the, the big old beams and they're relatively inexpensive. Um, in the meantime, let's, we're almost done cutting through all of these guys. We do have agents coming from both the south and the north, which is terrifying, but great all at the same time. I want to make enough money here to possibly build another one of these Dagons because, oh yes, this is, this is where I'm starting to feel like the reds maybe have a chance. You know what I mean? Like this, this feels nice. This is really nice. Okay, a couple more up here. Beautiful, beautiful work. I absolutely love it. Okay, was there any more of those other ships up to the north here that we can kill? Because there was some good R from those guys. So let's go up and see if there's any more of those. Oh, yes. Journey. Here comes that fact. Oh, here comes that, uh, that agent. Okay, so maybe we will go back, <laughs> collect a little bit more. I want to be able to build one more. How much is it to build this ship, I wonder? Hold on, let's just... Uh, it's uh, 34.59, okay? So we're about halfway there. We've got uh, about 1,600 R. We need 3,400 to build another one. Oh, perfect. Let's go grab that R before this before our friendly takes it from us. Wow, those motherships are actually quite effective. Surprisingly effective. Oh, just, just barely nicked him. Okay, come on, guys. Yeah, you got him. All right, good job. Good job. Let's go down. We've got agents coming south and north. I, I just... I just don't know if we're going to be able to hold up against that many agents. I guess it just depends on what we're about to face. I don't know. Oh, a stray little Borg ship. Aw. <laughs> I crushed thee. Oh, look, more Borg. Oh, fantastic. There's more Borg to the east of us. Wonderful. Actually, that's great. Um, little, a little late. Like, I would like to be, be able to build that ship now. I don't think we're... Yeah, we're not going to be able to pull it off. Let's go trade the rest of our R2... Yeah, we just don't have time. We're going to trade the rest of our R to our mothership here so that we don't lose. Unless there's something else. Well, you know what? I'd rather just trade. Come here, come here, come here. C. Trade, 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 trade. Let's get rid of everything. Perfect. Now, now if we get destroyed, I'm not too worried. We've already uh, sold our R. Um, of course, I would love to build some more of the... Uh, he, let him build some of the other odd ships. We've got some Humboldts flying around, which is great. The Humboldts are actually quite a fantastic... Oh, agent. Agent. I'm, I'm on him. <laughs> look, he's got some railguns, or what are those? I'm not sure. Those look like, uh, I don't know, but I'm chasing him down. He's mine. There he goes. <laughs> 300 R for him. Wonderful. Let's go find the rest of their group. I thought that might have been the leader, but no, I think the leader gets a triangle. They get a, tri a big red triangle on him, like a big target. <laughs> uh, so we've got them coming from the north, too, so we do have to be extra cautious. These guys are, these guys will go down pretty quickly with the Tempest. I'm feeling quite powerful with the ship, man. Feeling quite powerful. Look at that. It's just, it just, ah, just so much firepower all at once. It's so great. Yeah, he's a little far away. Get, get a little closer. I'm thinking I might have to add some more engines to this. This is going to be our main ship. We're going to keep adding onto this ship because, man, oh man, this is beautiful. I think, you know, adding an engine in every direction might be a really good idea. Okay, we've got to get closer to this guy. He's a, they're a little faster than me, so that's the only downside. Um, the drones are doing their job. Um, take care of these little guys before they get to... Oh, those... Yeah, those are uh, big old plasmas or rail guns or something. There it goes. wonder what the uh, leader's going to look like. Okay, so let's kill off some of these little guys. There we go. Big guy. Cut off his engines. There he goes. Beautiful dogfights. Oh, I love it. Engines are down. Ah! <laughs> what an awesome ship! I love this ship! Ah, it gets pinned and then we can just... <laughs> this is great! We have not killed the leader yet, so they can't still reproduce. There he goes! Ah! The drones are actually enormously helpful! They are actually doing a great job at distracting those ships, which is wonderful. Oh! Oh, that's a friendly. <laughs> Beautiful. I feel like we're starting a, you know, like we're, we almost have a faction war. This is the leader. Kill the leader. There he goes. We gotta get out of here, man. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. No! No! Did you see how much R we just lost? That's insane. Oh, good. Our guys are getting. I, I think our guys are gonna get it. Okay, gotta get back into the battle. We had. I should have hit the F button. We could have. We could have reproduced. Oh, uh, it was too late. Some of these guys must have a lot of R on them. 
maybe even our ship has took that R. I don't know. Let's kill as many as we can. The problem is we, there's too many ships out here. Okay, we gotta do this. Ah, healing drones, or healing beams. I love it. What? I'm heading... Turn, turn, turn. Let's go the other way. Come on. This way. I can't... I'm stuck or something. I can't... I'm being dragged. What's going on? I'm being dragged? It doesn't make sense. I can't... There we go. There we go. There we go. For some reason, my engines wouldn't fire. That was weird. And it felt like I was being dragged along. What if the, uh, heal, the healing drone there, the healing beams, I wonder if they do that. I wonder if they have kind of a tractoring effect. I don't think so, though. It'd be cool if they did. Heal up. Man, we lost all that R. What a shame. But we did kill the leader. Beautiful. I finally feel like we, you know, at least we're, we're holding our own for the most part. We have dealt with uh, multiple agents at this point. And, uh, you know, uh, we're constantly at war here. This is fantastic. This is like a major war. Die. Die. Slowly getting used to these uh, these tempests. Oh, look at the look at the drones tear them apart. Lovely. Beautiful, beautiful job. Lovely. We've got to get about 3,600. 3,600 for us to uh, buy a brand new ship. We've got to get out of here. We are actually taking some serious damage. Let's head back to our mother ships. <laughs> we have no engines left. Uh, they keep shooting off all of our engines, but and they try to get through the uh, tempest, but they they're they're really struggling to get through that thousand thousand hit point armor. Lovely. Set back up a little bit, a little bit of safety. Oh, there's the other the other uh, agent. Oh no, I don't know. Ooh, big lasers. That's probably not good. Take care of these little guys. Uh, we are actually in trouble. Those lasers will rip us apart, man. We got to get out of here. Oh, no. Can't quite... Oh, we got him. We got the, the agent. <laughs> or one of my guys got the uh, leader of the agents. Fantastic. That's another agent group down. We are actually doing quite well. Go team. <laughs> These guys, the guys that I'm fighting, they kind of look... Uh, I don't know. They're kind of bizarre looking. I like them. I like them. Look at them. <laughs> Very cool looking ships. Very nice. Those lasers, though. I, I am concerned about those big old proton beams or whatever they are. I think they're proton beams. Ah, lovely. Ah, oh, they're, the, the, the Borg's picking on him, too. Let's kill this Borg. Get rid of the Borg. Hey, back off. <laughs> nice little sweeper for uh, drones. I love it. Beautiful fight. Oh, man, what a great little dogfight. That was so good. We did die once, but considering we were playing the Reds, um, we did pretty well. Let's. It's time to build ourselves a brand new ship. Another one of my own. Or another ship. Uh, another Dagon. Another Dagon. Oh, I love it. Grow. Oh, hold on. That's not the right ship. There we go. Now we're building a Dagon. We built a Humboldt first, apparently. There we go. Beautiful. Couple more faction dudes to kill. Um, with the faction, with the, uh, or faction dudes, agents, a couple more agents to kill. With the agents down, um, we should be free to pretty much grow and prosper in this universe. I'm very excited now. There was, there's going to be some agents that I don't know if we're going to be able to beat with the Reds. For example, the Faction 7 guys. The uh, Faction 7 guys we saw before that had the uh, melee armor, they're going to be extremely tough. Okay, yes, we have another Dagon. Oh, lovely. Could probably build a couple more of these smaller dudes. There we go, beautiful. We'll go in and maybe finish these guys off. What an amazing fight. Man, that was good. <laughs> that was that was a, a, just an amazing fight. Considering we're playing the Reds and we did that well, I'm pretty impressed. Having more Dagons would be great. And I think we're definitely gonna add some more engines to these ships because uh, they are a little slow and the engines do get shot off fairly quickly. So having a couple layers of engines might be really beneficial. But in the meantime, let's make some money here. Let's destroy the Borg. <laughs> one after the one after the other. They do not stand a chance today. Ah, oh, lovely. Ah, oh, rip them to shreds, my pretties. Yes, I'm back to the my pretties thing. I can't help it. Once we start to once I start to feel power in this game, you know, like my head starts swimming with with enormous power, I just, I, with, you know, that feeling of delusions of grandeur, that's the words I'm looking for. I start to, you know, 
giant delusions of grandeur, even though I'm probably not that powerful in the grand scheme of things. But as far as, you know, comparatively speaking, relative to where we were, I feel that we've come a very long way. Look at this, we're just ripping right through them. There goes the humble. Oh, the humble died there. Well, that's unfortunate. Ah, oh, he did, he, he sacrificed himself. It was kind of a kamikaze mission. Rip through these four. Look at that. Oh, I love it. We're going to make a fortune here, guys. We're going to make an absolute fortune here. We almost have enough for even another one of the, uh, the Dagons. You know, having two or three of these on the wing would be uh, really awesome. <laughs> really almost unstoppable, except for agents. Now, well, that's not true. There's going to be some big guys. There's even some Faction 7 guys going to be at the core of the galaxy, which we might have some trouble with. I don't know. We'll see. Um, we're we're going to have trouble with plants, I think, in any scenario. I mean, we can try attacking the plants now. The plants might be okay. I don't know. We, we might have enough armor to pull it off, but I don't know. I guess we're going to have to wait and see. Oh, this is great. Uh, we've got uh, 2,300 and growing. We need we need about another 35, 3,600 before we get another dag on. And then in numbers, I don't know if this could be beaten. Uh, at least not in this galaxy. I don't know. Maybe against other other agents. That's the, that's the only thing is other agents, right? Wonderful. Cut through it. Yes. Yes. Break it down. Destroy them all. <laughs> it's too bad you can't play the play the Borg. I think uh, the Borg would be kind of fun. I, I, mind you, there really isn't much choice for weapons. I think they have... They're kind of like the bees. Many In many respects, they're very much like the bees. Okay, so let's grab this station here. Oh. Sure, might as well kill these guys while we're waiting. <laughs> oh, lovely. The Borg ships are a little bit more dangerous. They do, like like I said, they have a they have a laser of some sort. I, I'm not sure exactly what... It looks, looks a little bit like a Gauss cannon, maybe? It's a shorter range, kind of a burst laser, sort of. I don't know. I'm gonna, I would have to look, I'll have to look at that one day. Wonderful. So the Borg are going down just about completely destroyed. Well, they have still quite a bit of territory, but the great money from these guys overall. Generally speaking, we've, we've made more money in the last, you know, 10, 15 minutes than I think that we have uh, the first five episodes, the first four episodes of this series. Cut through them. Wonderful. Look at that. Beautiful. We're only getting like six or so for, for each kill, but uh, these ships have got a little bit more. But it's easy money. That's that's a wonderful thing. There's really low threat here. The board drones are a bit of a pain in the butt. Whoa, 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 whoa! There's that agent I was talking about. Kind of, kind of, kind of, get him, get him, get him, get him. Cut, 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 cut. Go, 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 go! Destroy the weapons. There we go. We got him. Woo! Kill those drones. Kill those drones. Come on, get this guy. Get this guy. We actually, we've got another agent on our doorstep. It is the Faction Seven agent. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, can I build another dude? I can build him. So we still need a little bit more money to build the last guy, or to build the uh, build another Dagon. Ah, uh, that's another Humboldt. No, that's the FS. Did what? Did we even name that guy? I'm not even sure if we named him or not. <laughs> uh yeah. So he's he's kind of our fighter, our fighter escort guy. He's kind of cool. I like him. He's fast, and he. I, I don't know if he's got the energy to actually support that Tempest. Wonderful. So the agents are going to be here any moment. We do have to be extra cautious. I need to make enough money to buy at least one more Dagon. I don't know where the other guy went. Maybe he got destroyed. Oh, who's that? Enemy, obviously. Kill it. <laughs> Die already. Wonderful. <laughs> is that enough? That is enough. We can build another Dagon. I wonder where the other Dagon went. I, he must, I must have forgot him. He, I left him behind somewhere. I don't know. Build, build my pretties. <laughs> Wonderful. I'm going to keep this guy on us, the uh, mothership. That way he can heal us up when we're, when we're in trouble too. Oh, those Tempests are just brutally, just wicked weapons. Extremely wicked weapons. Oh, look at that. I love it. Just cut through the asteroid. Take what I want. <laughs> oh, uh, agents, are they here? No, not quite here. But we do have a fully built... I, we must have lost our... I, I must have outrun my other Dagon. Unless he got destroyed. That is possible. That is definitely possible. Kill off the rest of this uh, work area. There we go. Beautiful, beautifully done. All right. Let's get our mothership. Come on, guys. Let's go... Let's go a little bit south and see if we can engage the other agent. These are the agents that uh, that have the melee armor. We do have to be extremely cautious here. Yeah, in numbers, I don't know if we're going to be able to fight them off. We have to 
do something about that melee armor. Kill the melee armor. Go, 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 go. Quick. Ah. Ah. Aha, another one destroyed. Wonderful. Actually, that's great. Perfect. Cut off that armor. If you can cut off that armor, we can probably kill him. Cut off the armor. Cut off the armor. Go, go, go. Yes. Yes. We've got him. <laughs> Lovely. Let's build a couple more uh, ships here. Wonderful. Turn around, turn around. All right. Excellent work. Excellent work. Oh, he's not dead though, the agent. Oh no, that we killed we killed the leader of another agent. Oh, that is lovely. Oh, we are growing in power, my friends. Ah, uh, yes. Build a couple more ships here. Oh, um, I think that's all that remains of that agent. And I don't know if this guy has melee armor on him. He, if he does, that is the only thing he could possibly do to make my life difficult is if he rams with any melee armor or something. Of course, we'll go down, but uh, I think he's pretty much finished. <laughs> Uh, another agent dies. Ladies and gentlemen, that's all I have time for. We didn't build any ships today. All we did was conquer. All we did was conquer. Look at, look at the wreckage. Look at, look at all the death and dismay that follows behind us. I love it. I love it. Look at this beautiful. We destroyed, what, four agents today? I destroyed one before I started recording and three others. This was absolutely magical. I love it. We will see you again in a couple days for another episode of Reassembly. Loving this playthrough. This has been super fun. Next time, we're going to start building some even bigger ships. All right. Take care. Bye, bye, bye.